All right, so I'm going to be real with you. That last reading, that sure was actually intended to be a regular reading. But the most high works in mysterious ways. So I'm just going to put my head down and get back to work. Let's see. What do we need to know? Other than we may need to lock down our social media a little bit. Just saying, you feel me? Somebody's watching from afar. I see what's going on. Peeping timers. You feel me? Okay. We have Divine Masculine who may be up in their fields. Jonah said, Jonah said, I'm just the reader. I'm just the messenger. You feel me? I'm just here to do what I got to do. So first things first. All right. Praise to the most high. All right. Let's see. What is influencing? Oh, okay. Put that over there. What is influencing us at the bottom of the deck? King of Swords. I know this is a thinker. All right. As you can see, he's he's got a nice perspective of things. He's looking at things from a different view. All right, he's got two swords. All right, he's holding one in his hand. And he has that sword on his back pocket, back pocket in his backpack or something. And it looks like his crows, his messages are around him, are are sending his. He's receiving messages. His ancestors are definitely very much present in this energy's life. Now, this energy is doing a little bit of juggling. What's he juggling about? What do we need to know? What do we need to know? What do we need to know? Hmm? What do we need to know? Page of Pentacles. What do we need to know? They want to work with us. They have an offer to give to us. They're a little sad, upset. You seem to be living your best life, very much not bothered. All right, no communication coming from that, from this energy, no energetic pulls whatsoever. You're just living your best life while this other energy is going back and forth because they do want to work with you. Yeah, unfortunately, you closed that out, buddy. You were like, no, I'm moving forward. I'm taking control of the situation. And you moved rather quickly. All right. Maybe you received a download from the Most High. Okay, we just seen the King of Wands. Now we got the Queen of Wands. So it looks like you may have received some sort of intuitive nudge or message from the most high about a queen of wands king of wands because you're taking the action so about a queen of wands so you definitely felt that okay boom and that seems to be the scales being balanced all right that's justice now notice this is like all that base right the base right the base chakra right see all that base energy okay that's beautiful and then over here it's all that heart emotional stuff okay a little bit of thoughts in the bottom right there. But, yeah, let's move. Ten of Wands, Three of Wands. So it looks like they're creating a burden by just waiting. All right? The scales being balanced is this Empress. Is, are being The scales are being balanced for this Empress. And they're just watching from a distance, hurting themselves. She stepped on her throne by walking away from the situation. So by her cutting off the situation, by her moving forward... Her putting her boundaries and sticking to her guns and standing firm, knowing what she wants, moving forward. She put herself in that Empress energy, in that Empress chair on her throne to find the right candidate for her to commit to. Six of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, Eight of Swords. So now this energy, you know, they want to give an apology, a romantic offer. They want to give to this energy this empress who doesn't want to give to an empress come on now stop playing but um they definitely want to give to her all right they want to give to the situation they want to give to her unfortunately for them her mind is set she's moving straight towards her ten of pentacles all right a, a candidate who is reliable consistent persistent all right all about the bag who's loyal respectable loyal either to themselves or to their pack however the situation may be all right and she's made a final decision all right she's taking action and moving forward all right so what do we need to know that you're receiving your wish fulfillment everything you've prayed for looks like this generational wealth respect within your community all right you're receiving that in a brand new beginning yes you are okay what do you need to know all right your life is being balanced out this is the beginning of happiness all right you're beginning a whole new chapter closing that out okay what do we need to know somebody's gonna be watching and learning from you from a distance 
It looks to be that energy that you walked away from. All right. Okay. What else do we need to know? You're very much to yourself. All right. You're very much spiritual, but um, you're going to cause, there's going to be a tower. There's going to be a tower. Okay. Um, I believe it's because you're going to be receiving everything that you've ever manifested, ever wanted. You'll be celebrating. Possibly with your community, your friends and all that other stuff. Try a tower, please. Let's see what's good with the tower. Capricorn energy. Okay. Somebody's obsessing about you. This queen of wands, very attractive. Okay, let's see this tower, please. Tower, tower. Seizing an opportunity, moving in quickly to, to collaborate, to get that wheel to spin in their favor, wanting to balance things, work on things, reconcile with things. I don't know if that part was right, but you know what I'm trying to say. Okay. So there, when you, I, I don't know if you're going to hit your Ten of Pentacles. I don't know what that's going to be about, but um, what it seems like is they're going to charge in to get the wheel to spin in their favor or maybe to be a part of this with you possibly I don't know all right okay this is I want to say that all the hard work that you do has helped you become a boss figure, an emperor, okay? All right, whatever painful ending that was really helped you to become some sort of public figure, some sort of recognition. And it's almost as if you're uh, alchemizing and teaching people your ways, all right? Like you're receiving blessings. You are a gift to mankind, and it's as if you're being rewarded for understanding that. Maybe you were in a state of confusion about that. Holding on to undeserving energies that don't recognize you. But moving forward, it looks like you're able to receive your abundance. But you, but you can't be in a state of confusion. Okay? You had to learn that with the hermit. You had to study truth and clarity. Exactly. You have to know who you are in order for, um, for you to receive your abundance. Because if you have the wrong energies around you, and you're giving to these energies, thinking they're X, Y, and Z, giving them the benefit of the doubt... Uh, for one, you're more than likely carrying their baggage, their soul's work, or whatever they may need to get done in this lifetime, and you're slowing down the wheel. And then for two, you're not proving to the universe that you are mature enough to have these blessings. As you can see, like Queen of Swords, you're receiving your generational wealth. You're receiving your wish fulfillment, everything you pray for. You're receiving a brand new beginning, brand new relationship. You're receiving some sort of gift from the Most High. All right? Like, all, like this tower you're receiving is good is positive like bro like and you, all you had to do was acknowledge who you are to the most high all right and take action on it all right you couldn't just like talk about it you had to be about it too and you did that I'm very proud of you so what you need to know is you got to keep up that attitude keep up that demeanor keep up that godliness about you because apparently that's what was needed to get this wheel spinning in your favor. All right. So congratulations to you. Congratulations on understanding your power, how how you contribute to a picture, place or thing. And um, keep moving forward. You have major blessings, major blessings coming your way. All right. I claim this for myself. All right. So let's move forward. I love you all. Mucho mas. Let's just keep moving. All right. We got 9-11 on the clock. And um, truth is, we doing the damn thing. You feel me? Let's do this. Love and like, guys.